Anyway, this is just a short video in case anybody who's making mask. Um, to make the mask patterns and stuff, the best thing to do is to actually print out on the label stickers. If you have label stickers, or you can go to the store and get them. And then um, print them out just like that right there. Um, and tape it onto here. And then cut it out. And that's it. That's a it, quick, easiest thing. You can use, you know, cereal boxes. Or in this case, it's like, look at it. Big um, pizza boxes. I mean, these things are like heavy, heavy duty right here. You know? And they're very hard. So all you actually have to do. I know I'm making this really quick. All you have to do is just take this out. In here. Lay them on to where you want, of course. And sacrifice one layer, one side. I mean, you don't have to watch this, to be honest. You already got the idea. But if you feel like watching this... And then just match this up. Right here. Align it together. And there you go. Now, you just have to cut this out. And you would have your thing. Easy and quick and simple as that. Instead of, um, oh, I download, download this from them right here. Craftpassion.com. I like to give them credits for this pattern. Uh, although I can make it myself, but they already did it already, so I just download it. And I will link that in the description as well. And make sure when you print out, this is two inches. Just like they they, they, they did it. And that's it. That's all you have to do. These are my, um, I'm actually doing this for my dad because he's tired of wearing the same pre-made and although I know how to sew, um, so I gotta make new ones. That's a separate video, but this is just for pattern making for your mask. It would be a lot easier. Um, so I figured. I film it. In case somebody needs it. Um, in case somebody get idea from that. You know. It would be easier when you have this. And you can just trace right around it. It's the quick and easiest way. Um, I didn't really like this too much. So I'm actually going to modify it a little bit. Um, I didn't like this curve. Because this curve is going upward. I don't like that. I like just to go, you know, straight up. Um, so I'm just gonna curve it just a little bit. I'll, ex I'll explain that later in the in the video. So that's the only mod that I'm doing to this mask here. Okay, that's how you get your pattern. See, just a little bit of mod right there. Not much. Um, I would love to like come down to here though. Right here. I don't like that. Right there. Because once you fold this in, I'll show you really quick. Once you fold this in, you will have your automatically wire. I'll show you all that to the secret how I how I do it really fast, quick and simple. You know me, it's always about fast, quick, and simple. And then your, remember your, um, oh, another tip in case you're watching this video. If you're looking for the wire, sorry, I have to reach over you there. Cut them out. Coca-Cola bottles or cans or whatever. See it. it won't be as perfect, but it does form. And it does stay too. Once it's formed, it stays. Okay, 
And if you have your old mask, go take your old mask in and use one of these if you have an old mask. If not, cut them out of cans or cut, cut them out of thin metal. Just a thin metal and a scissor. Yes, you can cut that with it. You can also do um, uh, tin foil too. Some people do tin foil. But literally, literally, you can just get them from wires, um, uh, bag ties, and in my case, Coke. Coke cans. Okay. Other than that, that's about it on this video. Um, and this is just a quick tip on how to do your patterns on things and use cereal boxes um anything really cardboard boxes uh paper plates uh those large large paper plates you can do that too um anything that fits the pattern inside and then just tape it you know from a from a label and now you have your whole pattern to trace out whatever then this lasts for a long time this is for mass productions okay if you do that a lot that's what this is for. That's what this video is for. When you do a lot of them. Because I'm actually going to do a lot of them. So I need to make a sturdy pattern. So I can trace out. Okay. Other than that. That's about it on the video. And I will talk to you in the next video. Okay.